I think the, the foundation of that customer experience is the fact that, that our customers only log on one time. So um, to, to do your banking, to do your brokerage, you sign on and you have the ability to do both. Uh, the movement between those two, although you're going between multiple platforms, the reality is as a customer, you see that as only moving between pages, just as if you, you never left the website. Um, on top of that, we also offer the ability to move funds between bank and brokerage seamlessly, real time. Um, I think that makes us different than some of our competitors. I think some of the, just the look and feel of our website and how easy it is. Uh, we built this such that the bank is, is there to be convenient if the customer wants it, but not to be intrusive if our customers don't. So um, we really try to be conscious of the fact that we have some customers who come to Scott Trade to trade. And so therefore, they want to get in, do what they want to do, and do it quickly. And so we were very careful to make sure that when we built the bank, we didn't build it in the way so that people had to step over it if they didn't want that. Joe talked um, specifically about some of the look and feel and the, the way that we streamlined it. But down in the technical aspect he, uh, that far, we worked very, very diligently to give the same type of speed and performance in banking that we have in brokerage. Online brokerage clients have an expectation of a speed and performance that typically online banking clients don't. Just moving from brokerage, as Joe talked about, to the bank, building a tab function in there where it wasn't looking like it was launched out to something else and having all of that data pre-set in the system was critical to what we were doing so that when you clicked on the bank tab, even though you typically would go out to a third party, we already had that preset there so it was coming up for you instantaneously. I think that was a huge technological hurdle that had to be overcome and I, I think uh, we, we being the whole team did a fantastic job of making that happen. And there were a lot of little hurdles along the way. Um, some specific things were around the funds transfer capability. That, that was really throwing up some issues because you had a system that wanted to, to account for those transfers on a batch basis and another system that wanted to account for them real time. And tied to that from the funds transfer perspective, uh, you think of it as a technical challenge. It really wasn't just a technical challenge. There were business issues, regulatory issues, audit issues that all had to be taken into account when trying to make the decision of how we wanted to manage those funds, which the team did a great job, I think, of working together to say, okay, these are the ramifications from a business perspective. This is how we can make it work technically, and we came up with a great marriage on it.